mainly we are going to be discussing three different triangles, their properties as far as their angles, and we're really going to try to have fun with these triangles. So the first one we're going to look at is called a right triangle. The right triangle, as most of you should all know, has a right angle, basically 90 degrees. The actual definition for a right triangle is that it does have a 90 degree, 90 degree angle, and the sides of the right triangle satisfy the Pythagorean theorem, basically saying that this side equals a squared plus b squared. We will also notice that, again, that this angle is 90 degrees, that the other two angles will add up to 90 degrees, as we can see there, and that if we move this triangle, no matter what, this angle will always remain 90 degrees while the other ones can change, but will always add, add back up to 90 degrees. The next one we're going to look at is the equilateral triangle. Um, definition of the equilateral triangle is that all the sides and all the angles are equal. Basically stating that no matter how I were to move, this triangle, the sides could change, but would all be equal, but the angles would always remain 60 degrees. Finally, we have the obtuse triangle. Reason for the obtuse triangle is because it has an obtuse angle. But this angle is larger than 90 degrees, but less than 180. When you have an obtuse triangle, you will end up with two acute angles. These angles, the two smaller angles, will always be less than 90 degrees added together. And again, as we can see, if we move this triangle around, there will always be an obtuse angle at any time, though the obtuse angle can change where the two acute angles still stay less than 90 degrees. Finally, one of the most important part of triangles. The funnest part of triangles, and it makes them easier to figure them out. Out of all three of these triangles, you will see when you add up all three of the angles, they will always add up to 180 degrees. This is true for the right triangle, the equilateral triangle, or the obtuse triangle. And for any triangle, this is a property of triangle. So summing it up, we've had a few fun facts about triangles today, three of them with one very important property fact that you will learn further on as time goes on. Great.